Today we prefer this comment. Thank you for your activity. Oh my god, that was so satisfying. Please subscribe now for a year of joy. Wishing you a happy new year filled with captivating content. Thank you for being with us. Well, hey, what's up, you little freaks? How's it going? You already know that it is time. It's time to take this off again. I attempted to put my hair out of my face, but I can't see. So uh, I hope it. I hope I don't look crazy. <laughs> of course, I look crazy. Never mind. Never, never mind. Let's just take this off. Oh, yes. Ah. Is my eyebrow still there? I can't, I can't see. I hope it's still there. Time for this eye. Ding, ding, ding. Ah. Now I just gotta take the rest of this off. Now that I think about it, I probably should have taken my contacts out first. And once again, the removal process is scarier than the original look. Oh, God. Okay, I forgot to film that last part, but it's like three days later now and my face is clean. What time it is guys it's time to take this off again i cannot see because i'm wearing contacts um but i put both of them on which is new i could never put both contacts on but you know i can't see so i'm gonna attempt to take them off be right back i took them off you guys i don't even know where to start with this one. Oh boy Beautiful. There's some right there as well. Yeah. Boop. Gotta take this all off. I'll be right back. So I accidentally got latex in my hair, so I have to cut it off now. Cause latex doesn't come out of hair. Never mind, I got it out. Do you guys like my bangs? But anyways, good day you guys. Take off my makeup with me. This hair is so itchy. I don't know how men live with mustaches. Okay, it's time for them to come off. Oh, why did that kind of hurt? Maybe because it was glued to your skin, Sarah. <sighs> oh, I forgot I just shoved that up there. That's what she said. Time for this. This is actually a scarf and a wig in one. Um, Ooh. Wow. I think I'm literally just going to have to pick this hair off. Oh. Um, Oh my god, I feel like I'm actually getting a wax right now. I feel like this should be a Garnier ad right now. Quakey clay! Bye! Take off my makeup with me, Halloween edition. These have been falling off the whole time I've been filming. Half one in the morning. I'm just gonna take those off. Okay, now that my hands are free, I really had to improvise with this one and I actually used a Trigwell powder puff for the points in the wig. And now we can take this wig off, finally. Now, if you're wondering how I get this tooth enamel off, I'm also wondering that because it's my first time ever using it. My friend said that you can just brush your teeth and it comes off, so. Oh, okay. Now I'm just gonna use some cleansing balm because my brows are glued down, but most of this is water activated paint. So it should come off pretty easy in the shower. 
I'm literally just gonna shower from here. But the ears are always the worst bit, especially if you have piercings. What's up you little freaks? You already know what time it is. It's time to take this off again. I can't wait to take this off. Oh my god. But to give myself some credit, I'm really happy with how this turned out. I made these ears out of paper and wire and let's take them off. Ooh. This isn't even a correct bald cap. It's a, it's a hair cap. Wig cap is the right word. I forgot that word. This is air dry clay and my skin is not happy with it. It's squishy. I'm mentally preparing myself for being able to breathe again. Oop. Ah. What is this? I'm just gonna finish taking the rest of this off. And of course, we need the nightmare fuel. Oh boy. All right, the moment of truth. No, no. There is no way. <laughs> I took a shower. It's not, it's not coming off. Take off my makeup with me. I have lube everywhere. I have glue everywhere. I just put a whole bottle of glue on my desk. So I'm ready to get this off. Let's go in with the ears first. Ooh. Ah. Oh my God, my side pads. Oh. Yes, I used a Cocoa Pop box to make these. Ah. I'm using an oil-based remover ah, to get this off my neck. This, oh my god. Ah! Okay, well, this hurts less. Why do I do this to myself? Ah! Oh, ow. Ah. Get off. Let me just get some of this lube off. Everyone thinks it's hard to take contacts out with acrylics, but this is how easy it is. Boom. Lashes. Oh, those are big ones. Oh, and the other pair. Couldn't forget. I'm just gonna get the shower from here, but I'm praying that I'm not stained pink because I'm going to Paris tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Bye. Take off my makeup with me. Firstly, we're gonna start with this contact because I can't see hardly anything out of it. It's like 20% vision maybe in this one. This contact is a sclera contact, so I can actually see it out of it, but it's a lot harder to take out. That was easier than I thought. I'm gonna take these little icicles off. I just glued these on with Prozade adhesive. The cotton wool. And latex is a little bit trickier because that's actually latex to my skin and obviously cotton rips easy. Hmm. Ow. Lashes. And I'm just going to take some cleansing balm. This one is my favorite. It smells so good. Now the bump up. Let's see what happens when we rub them together. I hate the ears. Now I'm just gonna hop in the shower. Love you, bye. <laughs> Shh.
keep hitting record to take this makeup look off with you guys, but I just, I'm so proud of it that I almost don't want to touch it, but we must. All right. These are Ruben's glasses, by the way. And then I had these buttons that I got from Joanne Fabric. Now I gotta take out the paper pieces, which is honestly the worst part. This is cardstock paper, by the way, in case you guys don't know. It's probably about three times thicker than printer paper. And then this paper here is, what is it? It's like foam sheets. This is going to be a little harder to get off because the paper pieces that I used on here, I glued them on with spirit gum. But up here, I need to be really careful around the hairline. I've already ripped out so many paper pieces around my hairline that I have a lot of bald spots. <laughs> but for this stuff, I use Prosade, which this bottle looks disgusting right now. But it just holds on these thicker sheets a little better, like the foam sheets. Now for the nose, this part is cardstock paper as well. But I glued this one on with Prosade because I needed it to be like super glued to my nose. For the robe, I just used a long sleeve shirt from Joann's and then I cut out the center and then I took a different black shirt and then just stuck it along here to make it look like a robe. But yeah, you can see the shirt right underneath here and then I obviously just have a white shirt underneath to match his outfit. Now for the most satisfying part, I'm going to be dissolving all of this using a makeup bomb. So the best one that, I mean the one that I like the most is by Elemis. I mean there are other brands that I like a lot too, but this one I always gravitate to and it's non-greasy and it smells really good. Oof. I should poke myself in the eye. Now we'll get in the shower. <laughs>